what's in the box? Good morning, Harry. Good morning, Happy Farmers. And who's that box for? It's a special gift from Mommy Crocodile for all of us on the farm. A gift? Then let's open it. I wonder what's inside. <laughs> Sorry, Pico, but we need to wait for Mommy Crocodile, and I have to deliver all the other boxes first. This is really heavy. Oh, oh no! Bunny, hop! Uh, Harry, are you okay? Uh, my back. I can't move. Uh. Harry, can you get up? I don't think so. I'm stuck. Summer, let's take Harry to the stalls. You're right, Todd. Pico, can you help us out? Pico? Huh? Oh, sorry. I was just so curious about the box. Not now, Pico. We need to help Harry first. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is coming with us. To the horse stall! Here for the moment. Okay, Harry. Now I'm going to use my heat pad on the sore spot and then give you a little massage. That should have you up and running in no time. <laughs> That's great. I really need to deliver those boxes. Oh, or maybe I won't. Pico, can you do it for me? Don't worry, Harry. I'll take care of it. But first, let me open the box. Not now, Pico. Uh -huh. Okay. Remember, Harry, there's a solution to every problem. I'll go make something to help you. <laughs> oh, that's the spot. A little to the left, now the right. Oh, that's it. Oh, wow, I feel so much better. I just took the first delivery. But before I go, can I open Mommy Crocodile's box? Not, Not now, now, Pico. Pico. Huh? Okay. By the way, I think I can take <laughs> care of those boxes myself now. Oh. Thanks, Pico. Uh. <laughs> oh, oh, never mind. You need to be more careful. I've got an idea. I'll take care of the first delivery. Who are these huh? boxes for, Harry? Ah. These are for Doris. Be careful. Okay, see you later. Now just follow me. Straighten your back. Arms up and breathe. Straighten my back. Arms up and breathe. That's great. Wow, I feel re-energized and so alive. Thanks, Summer. Hey, I made you some crutches. Maybe you need more support. I just picked up the second delivery. Can I please open the gift now? Not, Not now, now, Pico. Pico. Okay. The crutches seem to be working, Todd. And thanks for delivering the boxes to Doris, Pico. I'll take care of the next bunch. <laughs> Yo! Oh boy, not this again. Okay, I'm running out of ideas here. I'll take back the crutches. Harry, these should be for Molly, right? Yeah, thanks, Pico. I'll go make something more useful. Here you go, Molly. Thank you so much, Pico. <sighs> That's it. The deliveries are over. I can finally open Mommy Crocodile's gift. I did it. I delivered all the boxes. Now, let's open the gift. No! We need to wait for Mummy Crocodile. She'll be here any minute. I can't wait any longer. Huh? Can you tell me what's in this box? Uh, huh? Huh? Freeze! I just realized every time you bend over to grab the box, your back hurts. You're right. I must be overextending myself. Actually, I think I've always lifted the box the wrong way. Watch 
Watch me. When picking up something heavy, you need to bend your legs, keep your back straight, and pull the box close to you and lift using your hips. You're right. Look at me. This is so easy and no pain. Good job, Harry. By the way, that box is heavy, so go slow. Whoa, look at you. Guess you won't need this back brace. What's in the box already? I can't take it anymore! <gasps> hey, here I am. Yay! We can finally open our gift. Sure, I hope you like it. My fine collection of decorated stones for uh, all of you. Decorated stones? Yeah, isn't that amazing? And I made them by myself. Well, that explains why that box was so heavy to pick up. They are just stones! Huh? Yes, and this one's for you. Oh, wow! It's so nice! Wow, these were worth the trouble. Great job, everyone! There's only one last thing to do. Time for a boxy dance! Troubles. A baby in the marketplace? Oh, oh, maybe we'll come back later. Harry? Hmm. I wonder what's wrong. Summer? This is my niece, Baby Hope. I've been chosen to babysit her. Great, Harry. She's got some voice. To be honest, I'm so worried I'll mess up. She keeps crying no matter what I do. Gee, Harry, are you sure she's okay? Maybe she's too hot. Or maybe she's too cold. No, no, she's fine. Believe me. Uh. I just want to be a good uncle for Baby Hope. <laughs> You are, Harry, and you totally got this. Thanks, Summer. You always have my back. <laughs> Maybe if I give her some milk, she'll feel better. Great idea! <laughs> to the cow shed! Oh, woody woody woo! A woody woody woo! Uh, hurry, let's get out of here before we cause more trouble. Come on, let's get the milk ready. <laughs> makes mistakes when they're nervous. Maybe you can help me open up this jar of baby food. Oh, I can do this. Watch, I call it my big horse bop. Ah. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, you do have what it takes to be a good uncle. Now let's feed this baby. If she's not hungry, she must be sleepy, right? There, she looks very comfy. She just needs a lullaby. Oh, I want to try. She's not.
not tired and she's not hungry. Now what? Hmm, maybe she's bored. <laughs> Let's do something fun. <laughs> 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 Nothing worked. Remember, Harry, there's a solution to every problem. She has the hiccups. Babies need to be burped when feeling gassy. I'll do it. You know what? I don't know what to do. You better handle it, Summer. That usually works. Ah. <laughs> Always makes that face right before she cries. She's not just gassy, she's super duper gassy. Harry, this is something only you can do. Come on, let's go somewhere quieter. Take hope and try to focus. I don't see what this is gonna do. Now, Harry, <laughs> time to show off your big horse, Bob. Uh, okay. <laughs> I think she's feeling better. <laughs> Let's take it from the top. Anymore. Actually, where are Harry and the baby? Shh, they're over here. <laughs> well, looks like you and Harry figured it out. <laughs> I have to give Harry all the credit. He has a special touch. Great job. Happy horse means time for a quiet horsey dance. <laughs> <laughs> the Seed Mystery! <gasps> All right, everyone! Listen! Seed Planting Day has finally arrived! Today, uh -huh. we're gonna work all Together to plant an all new crop of vegetables. <laughs> Amazing! Everyone must love planting day. Everyone except Harry. What's wrong? This bag of seeds. I don't know who I should deliver it to. I asked everyone, but no one knows who ordered them. Ooh, definitely a mystery. Hmm. Don't worry, Harry. Today is planting day. We'll be planting these seeds, too. Ah. You're right, Todd. When they sprout, whoever ordered them will recognize them and the mystery will be solved. To the vegetable garden. Bye-bye. We have so many seeds to plant that we split into oh. teams. Great. Where do we start, Todd? Let me show you. First, we'll plant the tomato seeds. Then, we'll figure out what to do with the mystery seeds. Yeah, Full power! Summer, look! Let's plant the tomatoes. Pour the seeds in here. Mm -hmm. huh? Huh? That's it! Now for the mystery seeds, Summer. I'll get them right away. Follow me. Let's go find a good spot to plant them. Uh, sorry, Summer. 
We won't be able to plant your seeds. The cedar broke down. Don't worry. I'll plant the mystery seeds. Huh? <laughs> that looks like a good spot. I'll just do what Pico does, and that's it. Mm. But, Summer, this hole is too big to plant your seeds. Oh? I didn't know there were any rules. Actually, I don't know much about seeds. Good thing you didn't plant them with the cedar, then. Come on, I'll show you. I'm planting peppers. Red, yellow, and green. They love sun. And this is a good sunny spot. Plant food. Mm -hmm. And water. Okay, now I know how to plant my mystery seeds. They look different. Maybe what's right for peppers isn't right for the mystery seeds. Now that you know how to do it, you can continue on your own. And I'll continue to sow the pepper. Thanks for the advice, Pico. I'll find a suitable place to plant my seeds. Hey, Summer! We're planting root veggies! Carrots, beets, and radishes! They need sandy soil, not too much hmm? water. How do I get it right? They look so different! Bad news, friends. I couldn't fix the cedar. I'm missing the drive belt. Look. I couldn't figure out the best place to plant the mystery seeds either. When you don't know what to do, there is always a friend who can help. Ow, 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 ow. Huh? Look at those crows over there. Hmm? I think they want to show us something. Um, here. There is the right amount of sun, but also some shade. The soil is sandy, but there is also the right amount of wet. Hooray! The crows helped us find the perfect place to plant the mystery seeds! What are we waiting for, Summer? Let's plant the seeds! An old boot! And this rubber string is just what I need! Now I can fix the cedar! Yeah! Today, we're solving the seed mystery. I wonder what sprouted. <gasps> wow, a flower. Oh. No wonder the seed looks so different. Not something you can eat, though. Passion flowers actually grow sweet fruit, called the passion fruit. My passion flowers. Huh, Harry? So it was you who ordered the passion flower seeds? Uh, it took him so long to get here that I completely forgot. I'm sorry. They're so good. I can't resist them. Everyone loves passion fruit. They'll be a hit at the market. Mmm. Wow. So sweet. Here, friends. There's some for you, too. We did it also thanks to you. Great job. There's only one last thing to do. Time for a seed planting day. The Horseshoe Competition! There you are, Todd! I've been looking everywhere! Uh, what are you doing? I'm shoeing the horses! Here on the farm, horses deal with all kinds of rough ground. So, they need to protect their hooves! Thanks, Todd. They're great! Sorry, Hope. <laughs> You're too young. How much longer is this gonna take? We all need shoes. 
please be patient and wait your turn. Lame. I could have run the track three times by now. For real. Please, no way. Not you. But I could have. As if. Want to try? You're on. If you're looking to lose, lace up. One, two, three, go! Hey! Oh, where are you going? We're not done yet. They are Chad and Tad? Are they your friends? My nephews. I told them they need shoes to protect their hooves, but they don't pay attention. Since they got here, the others follow them and no one listens to me anymore. They're young horses and into sports, but we have to shoe them for their own good. <laughs> Careful, Hope. It's dangerous. Chad, Tad, you need new shoes or you'll ruin your hooves. <laughs> Summer and Todd, what up? Here to race? <laughs> Summer, get it! Hang on! You two okay? We're fine, but we gotta do something to get their attention. Oh, I have an idea. I loved getting new shoes back in the city. Sneakers? Chad and Tad are flashy and fashionable. They're just the types who would love new sneakers. I think I get it. Meet me at the barn. What did you two come up with this time? Oh, just wait and see. Ta-da! Sneaker horseshoes. Wow! These are so sporty. Chad and Tad will like them for sure. And if they wear them, the other horses will too. Hmm. What do you think, Harry? I'm not sure they'll listen, but I'll try. I'll go get them. Okay, Chad and Tad, we've got to shoe your hooves. Stretch it now. Talk later. Totally. If those two keep it up, we'll never get their shoeing done. Those are very special horseshoes. We made them especially for you. Whoa, these are on point. Very cool. These colors are slick. Finally, let's get started. Hold up, Chad. Look. These make the other ones look basic. Make me want to jump. Then let's take it up a notch. I challenge you to an obstacle course with horse jumps. Come on, I'll flex on you so hard. No, wait! Not again. They'll hurt themselves at this rate if we can't get shoes on them. I'm sorry. If only I could get them to listen to me. Relax and take a deep breath. I'm sure mm -hmm. you'll come up with something. You're right. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Everything is a competition with them. We'll have a contest to test out the new shoes. Great idea, Todd. I'll organize the contest and Harry will be the judge. I'll go set up the track. <laughs> okay, everyone. Let's have a contest. Tad gets wing shoes. Chad gets red and yellow shoes. The winner will settle which is best. <laughs> Racing or jumping? Both. Todd has set up a special track. And Harry will be the judge. Right, Harry? <laughs> Harry, get to the starting line. Summer, give me a hand. Remember, hold still. All right, let's get this race going. Tad, get ready to eat my dust. Enough, you two. We've got to get the race started. Are you ready? Let's hope this works. On your marks, get uh -huh. set, go! <laughs> Wow, Uncle 
Eagle, we've never seen you race before. That was like crazy. What do you say? Would you be our coach? Huh? Uh, oh. <laughs> now every horse wants to get shoed like you, Harry. We don't even need special shoes. They want regular ones like yours. <laughs> Good race today, but it's time to clean up, gather the hurdles, and sweep the track. Great job, Harry. There's only one last thing to do. Time for a horseshoe dance! <laughs> Come join us at Sunshine Farm! Subscribe to the channel!